Lewis here and welcome to a possible new series if y'all wanted one or not. We are playing Fallout Shelter. Okay. And uh, a friend told me about like the Fallout games and she's wanting me to get the new one called Fallout 76. And because that's going to be coming out like November or something. And I'll get that soon. I can play it on the Xbox and we'll do a multiplayer thing on there. And for now, we're going to be playing some Fallout Shelter, so let's enter a vault. Okay. Now you have to determine the ID of your vault. Choose carefully because once you select an ID, it can't be changed. Let's see here. Mm, four. 400. Let's go. 400. Vault, congratulations, Vault Tech is selected to be the overseer of Vault 400. The vault keeps people safe from the dangers of the wasteland. As overseer, your job is to expand and maintain the vault while keeping your dwellers safe and happy. Each room has a special attribute. It uses assigned dwellers with, in, with the best special to make them happy and provide extra resources. Vault Tech will give you a daily rating based on your performance. Remember to keep your dwellers happy and do a great job. Please stand by. Okay. Let's see what this game back is about. Real quick guys, if you're new, go ahead and hit the like button down below and subscribe. Comment down below if you subscribed and... Let's just see how this goes. See Welcome to your new vault overseer. Let's introduce you to the basic concepts. First, let's build a room. Tap on the hammer icon to open the build menu. You will build a power generator that will produce power. Tap on the power room. Your rooms require power to function. Tap again to confirm. Mm, let's go here. Oh, oops. Now we need dwellers to make power generators to produce power. Look, dwellers have shown up at the vault door. Oh, hello. Roger Richards. You can see the dweller special stats. This info tells you where dwellers can be used most efficiently. So to sign, tap and hold on the dweller and drag them to the room. Try assigning the dweller to the power gen I didn't even know I was supposed to do that. Right there. And you. Also going to go in that room. Take your time. Okay, now that dwellers are working, the room will start producing resources. Double tap on a room to take a closer look. Ooh. If you are in dire need of extra resources, you can use this rush mode. Tap the rush mode. Okay. Thumbs up. Great. You successfully, successfully completed your first rush and collected caps. 534 caps, I'm guessing. Let's build a second room. A, a diner. Let's build the diner over here. Now let's build one more room. Water treatment. Let's build that one. Right there. Great work, here's some food and water to start your vault. Look at the readers to keep track of your resources and needs. Look, more dwellers have shown up at the vault door. No, no, nobody did. Um, look at Richard's energy. Now that you have progressive rules over here, so you keep expanding your vault. Just remember to keep your dwellers alive and happy. Good luck. Okay, so. What's your name? Heather Lewis. You can be 
diamond lady. One, it can be water supply. It can also be water supply. I didn't get the time to look at your name. This girl, I'm gonna make diner. Actually, no. This guy is gonna be diner. your office, okay. Um, we'll live for this. Oh, that's right. Like, there's like a one down here. Stimpack. 500 caps. Teddy bear. Initiate rogue. Plasma rifle.
this is like so confusing. Everything was just thrown on to me once. But what oh, was like oh. what's this? to do the roof. Much easier, much easier. Okay, get what is this to fifty fifty? Okay, it's like when oh, I got this, I got this. That does. Okay, I don't know what that said though.
Okay. No. Yeah. I'm gonna keep looking into this game, but I hope you guys have enjoyed this so far. And I really enjoyed playing this, but hope you guys have enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.